So we use um, the molecules on breath in order to diagnose a variety of acute infections, including agents such as strep pneumonia, staph aureus, and Legionella. It turns out that we can use breath to distinguish between whether or not you've been exposed to a pathogen or whether you have the infection or you've cleared the infection. This will impact the patient population in a variety of ways. Let's say you have an infection. At the moment it takes two to four days at least in order to diagnose the infectious agent. With this technology we're able to test someone's breath and within 30 seconds give you a diagnosis. With our technology, a clinician is able to go in, measure the breath of the patient, get feedback about what's causing the infection, and then treat much earlier. The technology is also useful for patients with a chronic infection. So if you have a chronic infection in a patient population like those with cystic fibrosis, then typically you want to know if you have a pathogen present, but you're also interested in the phenotype of that pathogen. And what that means is something like antibiotic susceptibility or whether it's more slimy or less slimy because all of these uh, nuances impact a clinical treatment decision.